lot of you guys in here remember a couple years ago when I said that uh, one day I was just going to walk in here and say, you know what, I think I'm done, take it easy, and just kind of walk out of here. I tried to tell Ozzy I wanted to do that, but he wouldn't let me. He made me have this uh, press conference, so I decided uh, to come here and um, uh, just say my thanks. Um, you know, it's been a great 12-year run. Um, this town has been amazing to me. Obviously, I want to thank Art Modell and David Modell, the Modell family, for trusting that another man I want to thank, Ozzie Newsom, for bringing me in here over Lawrence Phillips. I think that was a good decision, still to this day. Uh, you know, uh, I'd like to thank uh, Brian Billick, um, John Harbaugh, Steve Bashadi, um, everyone in this organization who has been, you know, the crutch for what all players, we all lean on everybody in this building, um, from Ed Carroll in equipment to Bill Tessendorf, uh, in the back, and I just want to say that I could not have done all the things that I've done on this, uh, in this career here if it hadn't been for these guys, so I want to thank you all as well. I guess you kind of want to know what made me decide that it was time to go. Um, I'm sure someone asked me the question. I might as well go ahead and get it out right now. Um, you know, I've, I've, when you play football as long as I have for 22 years and you play at a high level, it's really difficult to, that when you know that injuries just won't let you play at the level that you all and myself expect me to play, it's really difficult mentally. Could I have still gone out there and played? Yes, probably, and still done a, an adequate job. But in my mind, I wouldn't have been helping the team as much as I needed to, and it wouldn't have been good for me. And um, right now, I just want to see all the young guys, you know, Jared Gaither, Adam Terry, I'm going to still stay around here, commit to helping these young guys get better because, you know what, I'm a Baltimore Raven for life, obviously. How clear are you that this is forever? As far as forever playing football? Oh, I'm, oh yeah. <laughs> you ain't got to worry about me coming back. I, <laughs> that won't be happening. Uh, you know, that's why it took me so long, really. I mean, I knew probably about, well, I knew at the end of last season that I probably wasn't going to come back, but I, at the same time, when you make a decision like that, you need to give it time. You don't make that decision just on a whim. So um, when I decided about a month ago when I talked to Ozzy, I knew that I wasn't coming back. But um, I just wanted to find the right time to come here and announce it and try to, you know, like he said, just not interfere with what's going on in the Baltimore Ravens uh, because we got a lot of good things going on around here. And uh, I just kind of wanted to be a side note to it. You know, it's a mixed emotion, um, honestly. Um, there's a huge part of me that still is going to miss playing football. There's no doubt about it. I've been, like I said, I've been doing it for 22 years. But at the same time, I realize that it's time. You know, um, you know, they say that you know when it's time, and, and you really do. Um, I know that I gave everything I had out here for 12 years. Um, I left it out there every Sunday on the field uh, for this town and for myself and for this organization. And um, I can look back and say I have no regrets on how I played and, you know, what I did out there on the field. So, you know, I'm a little bit kind of like I wish I could come back, but at the same time it's like, you know what, you did what you had to do, and it's time to move on. So I'm at peace with that, really. <laughs>